Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to CFL Central, CFL content for the fans, by the fans. And we have a bit of a strange video here. It's just me today. Uh, literally, me and Rick have been trying to coordinate for this video all week, but we just have not been able to do it. Our schedules have just been completely all over the place. We've both been very, very busy. I'm back in college now, so that is a whole other obstacle. So my sincere apologies for being late on this video. We got th only three games this weekend. Uh, obviously, one of those games has already occurred. Uh, in regards to the one game that has already happened, I'm going to be very, 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 very brief on that. Uh, this is pretty much like I, I had I had no expectations. I, and I also didn't really care that much. If the Bombers won, if the Bombers lost, doesn't really matter. Make sure no one gets injured. Don't play the starters for the most part. And yeah, that's pretty much exactly how that went. And uh, yeah, we'll talk about that in the review. But that was just kind of exactly what... Uh, that was pretty much exactly what I'd, I'd predicted. If anything, I've predicted the game would maybe be a little closer in that regard. But it, even then, again, it's a nothing game. It's a nothing game. Um, but yeah, so that was pretty much that game. But going into the Saturday game, we got to the Hamilton Tiger Cats versus the Montreal Alouettes. So good, um, interesting start here. Because if we're looking at it, Alouettes and Tiger Cats are facing each other. Coming in in the Eastern semifinal. This will be the Eastern semifinal. So just kind of convenient that it lines up with this week. So this game, not worth uh, not worth anything, but it's going to be worth something the, the next week. So I think what's going to be really, really important for both of these teams is not showing their cards. It's going to make sure, pull out a lot of those starters. It's fine to lose this game. And more importantly, if you got any trick plays up your sleeve, now is not the time, chance to give that a whirl. Because you don't want... To, you you want to give them the most un uh, you want to you don't want to show your hand you want you want to you want to run a lot of very very basic plays you don't want um you don't want to let them get used to you don't keep it moving keep it keep it simple keep it basic and before you're going to go a little bit more wild in the playoffs, I think you actually absolutely have to. So the key for both of these teams is going to be making sure they don't show their hand and that, um, you know, if you can sneak out a win, probably be nice though. Um, so, so yeah, I mean, that's pretty much all I have for that. Uh, who wins? Uh, I'm going to give this one to the Alouettes. Yeah. I, um, I just, I, I just, you know, I think, uh, the Alouettes will, and it's simply because I don't think uh, either team is going to address that many starters. And I think the Alouettes will maybe dress slightly more just because it is a home game. Um, so that's pretty much my only rationale. But again, it is a nothing game. But we got the last one of the week as well. We have the Toronto Argonauts versus the Ottawa Red Blacks. And so this is, it's honestly, it'd be hilarious if the Ottawa Red Blacks was able to prevent the Toronto Argonauts for going 16-2. and two. And for them to put a stop to that. I believe, um, I'm going to go take a look here. I believe that would tie a league record. Let me check three down nation. I believe, I believe that would tie a record. I don't see it here. Unless did the CFL itself pause about it? Here at CFL Central, we do not prepare in advance. We just... We just watch as stuff happens. Oh, here we go. With the 16th win, the Toronto Argonauts can tie the CFL record set by Edmonton in 1989, uh, which they can. But again, it's one of those things where if if you're Toronto, even then you're not you're not you know you're not playing starters. You're not risking it because at the end of the day, would it be nice to tie that record? Absolutely. However, Grey Cup is what you want, and that's the thing. As 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 a Bomber fan, that's I was hoping we'd pull out a bunch of guys in our game against Calgary, and I was I was you know pleased uh, and so it's one of those things where you know Cameron Dukes will be starting this game uh, against the Red Blacks and the Red Blacks they got to figure out a direction they just they have no quarterback stability you know Jeremiah Mazzoli I don't think will, uh, will return I think this is you know the sad end to his career it's just just absolutely shitty it had to end this way and you know that Garrett Marino hit was just that was the the beginning of the end um, of Jeremiah Mazzoli. So, you know, maybe he'll come back. I don't know. You know, maybe he'll pull an Aaron Rodgers and he'll be like, I am going to, I'm not going to listen to anyone. I'm going to come back. I'm going to get it done. I'm going to kick ass. You know, maybe that, maybe, maybe he's just pulling an Aaron Rodgers. I don't know, but I don't see it. And so, you know, Dustin Crum, that's the man they're with right now. And if you're Ottawa, you got one last game at home 
and you have the opportunity to spoil Toronto um, and to spoil the fun. So if you're if you're Ottawa, that's I guess what you're looking to do. Overall, that's kind of all we have. Um, my apologies about this. Normally, you have the nice uh, little banter between uh, me and Rick, and we go into a bit more depth here. But it's one of those things where uh, just schedules just couldn't align. But I wanted to make sure there was at least something for you guys. So um, make sure you guys like, share, and subscribe if you have not already. Uh, and yeah, we will um, comment down below what you guys think. Of this week's games. Obviously there was a game that already happened. But then the two coming tomorrow. Or today I guess when this video comes out. I'll have to see. Uh, but yeah. Make sure you guys take care. I'll see you guys next time. Touchdown!